like this one work? Yeah. Like we always do. Come on, say cold water. Cold water. Say warm water. Warm water. Say hot water. Hot water. Say hot water. Yeah. Hot Everybody, Joe Tessitore evening, alongside Teddy Thomas Atlas, and welcome to the Thomas and Mack Center just off the Vegas Strip for a much anticipated main event. Ten rounds among heavyweights between Mike Tyson and Big George Foreman. Mike Tyson's got his eye on the prize. Look at that focus and determination during his ring walk. George Foreman's unpredictability belies his ring walk focus. He is ready for action. for 10. Wow, two of the best power-punching heavyweights of any generation now. Iron Mike Tyson facing off against Big George Foreman. Give me something to look for. How do you distribute your power? That's what I'm going to give you. And what is effective in that situation with that particular guy? George Foreman has a really good uppercut. Tyson, coming in the shorter guy, he is vulnerable to that punch. <laughs> Well, that was his intention, and that's what he's doing. Not engaging Come in the on, fight, guys. but Keep clinching. Come on. Excellent counterpunch by Tyson. He returns the favor with a right hand of his own. Good work. Two clean shots get in by Mike Tyson. There's the headshot, but he parries it away. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by Mike Tyson. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good on work now. by Let's George Foreman. Those uppercuts that George Foreman was able to land on Joe Frazier and winning the heavyweight title, they were lifting Joe Frazier off the ground. You know, Joe Frazier, because of his style, as terrific as he was, he was made to order for George Foreman. And there he counters back against his opponent. <laughs> Mike Tyson's resting up after a round in where he was so very accurate. And Teddy, if you want to have one single quality out there as an offensive fighter, accuracy is among the ones you want to have. Yeah, to be accurate, that means you have to be calm and you have to be smart, that you know that you're putting the punches in certain specific places for a reason. And boxing is not just about the strongest guys. It's supposed to be, and it usually is, about the smartest guys. Here we go. Round two is underway. Locks it away. Good counter punch. Comes right back 
at him with a left hand. One hook deserves another. Wow. Oh, George Foreman's in a bad spot right now. He's been stunned. Not precise at all. Early on here in the round, and he's already down. And he doesn't look good at all. Big George Foreman able to get up after that knockdown, and now a real challenge in front of him. Now the challenge right now is really the opposite of any challenge that he's ever faced before. Usually the challenge is how to get rid of a guy. He was able to get up and continue on last time. Now he goes down again. <laughs> Mike Tyson's gonna be partying tonight. A knockout victory. It doesn't get better than that. By way of knockouts, your winner, Iron Tyson. Mike Tyson's your winner by impressive knockout victory. And he did it just the way he had to. Stayed on the outside and used those quick hands all night. Yeah, good one for the fans. Glad you tuned in to see it with us. I'm Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas saying thanks for being with us.